Hello, my name is Ola Dorgan. I'm a T46 um, Paralympic sprinter and right now we're at Bolton Arena. I got into sport when I was really young and I'd always enjoyed running. Like I remember in primary school where we used to race to the far end wall, which was about 80 meters away. And there was always so many bragging rights up, up for scratch. And right now it seems like such a minor thing, but I always enjoyed it. My diet is a very important thing to me. And um, I have to be really strict with my diet. I have to eat a lot of carbs, a lot of meat. I have to cut down the amount of fat I take. And um, because I have to cut the amount of fat I take, I have to train constantly. On a weekly basis, Monday, I will have a track session. Tuesday, I'll be in the gym. Wednesday, I'll, have, I'll go jogging, two miles. Thursday, I'll have another track session. Friday, I'll be in the gym again. Saturdays I get off as rest days and Sundays tend to be um, race days. Two years ago is when I got on the um, World Class Podium Talent Programme. It's where we have 33 athletes, podium development and talent funded athletes. There's support from talent managers, ind individual PRs, um, many strength and conditioning coaches and external coaches and because we don't just have one coach who will give us the same training program week in, week out. Instead, we have a couple coaches, but they may not be our particular main coach. We receive an array of training and this helps to adapt to all sorts of situations and training aspects. People stereotype um, Paralympic sport as it's disabled sport, where it's not about the disability, I've always found, it's about the ability, because Despite the fact one may be missing an arm, you still have two legs. And by pushing the body to its anatomical limits, you are able to achieve a greater sense of purpose and a greater sense of achievement. And the times when I'm more confident are more sort of local competitions where, where it's less serious, it's more of athletics for fun. Where at the bigger competitions, there can be a large element of competition and that can sometimes bring on a bit of nerves, but it also helps with the, comp with the confidence when you walk out onto the track. Because I play so many sports, I've naturally become competitive and I have a, a good drive to win and a good drive to achieve things. The, the feeling, um, the kinesthetic feeling which you get from athletics and the feeling of winning and being able to enjoy that win and the fact that you can be proud that you've worked hard and achieved something which not many people in the world do achieve because in the Olympics and Paralympics a thousand people may enter but only one person can win in the end. And I think those things will continue to inspire generation after generation which is why athletics is a sport which has survived for so long ever since ancient Greece where it all began. It's still here today now. I think it will continue to be here for many generations and centuries to come.